Hello! And welcome to Florida E-Tick or Treat. Presented by Attractions Magazine. This is our second episode to our month-long series that's focusing on all the best things to do for the Halloween season, not only here in Florida, but also in California. That's right. Our second episode, we are taking you to Mickey's Halloween Party at Disneyland Park in California. This is my first time going there during the fall. I've never been to this event either. Have you? I haven't been to the event because now you have to pay extra. It is an extra cost, but I went when it was open for everyone else. So I haven't been there in a while. I'm sad we missed that. I wish we had been there for that. But I am excited to go because I want to see the difference between their Halloween party and Mickey's not-so-scary Halloween party that we actually went to yesterday here in Florida. So I want to kind of compare the two. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's go. Hey, what's Hey guys, I'm here at Disneyland Park at Mickey's Halloween Party. I am so excited. This is my first time here. And just like in Walt Disney World, it is a separated ticketed event. So you have to buy a ticket to this, but it is worth it. It looks like a lot of fun. We're just getting started. There's lots of trick-or-treating. There's new parades. There's characters. Awesome music. And look, the castle's even got some projections going. Let's have some fun. Suddenly, monsters all around. Suddenly my brain's letting go and I laugh out loud As my elbows crash into an eyebrow Thinking what the hell I'm gonna make it somehow Run into a closed liquor store, break the window Grab a bottle of gin, take a swig, oh no Stepping on a slimy lump Does Mickey's Halloween party give you fireworks, parades, and trick-or-treating, but it also gives you dance parties, special bill and meet and greets, and of course the cadaver dance on the rivers of America, floating in fog. It's amazing, you gotta see it. But I'm gonna go around and uh, check a few of these dance parties and of course trick-or-treat some more because I'm a kid when it comes to Disney, so let's go. This dad is critical. Chucks, five, six, knee kicks, practice on bricks, heads to the left, heads to the right, oh, round kicks flying as they fall to the floor. One, two, three o'clock, grab my nunchucks, five, six, knee kicks, practice on bricks, heads to the left, heads to the right, oh.
Now, just like in Florida, at night during this party, Main Street USA comes to life in a whole new way with really great projections, lights, and of course, music. But here in Disneyland, they are actually utilizing this year the projections that they use for the 60th anniversary fireworks spectacular that they had last year. So it looks really great. Let's go check it out. All right, guys, while Gavin's down there on Main Street USA, I decided, why not? Let's go trick-or-treating. That's what you do here at Mickey's Halloween Party. So a little different from ours over there on the East Coast is that here they have trick-or-treat trails. I know you're saying we have them too, but over here, that's mainly what you're gonna see. And they have multiple stops within that trail. So it's nice, but there is a line to get to that candy or the goodies, because let me tell you what, what I've seen, apples, amazing. Hey, by the way, remember when Adventureland used to give out bananas? Those were the days back in Magic Kingdom. But anyway, let's go trick or treating because I'm ready for some candy. Let's get our Halloween on. everyone we're here with Bo one of the candy makers here at the Disneyland Resort now can you tell me what we have here so we have a whole assortment of our Halloween time offerings that the candy production does okay so we have our Jack Skellington apple goes along with the Nightmare Before Christmas theme of Haunted Mansion to go along with that we have one of our newer items it's the Jack Skellington marshmallow one so it's his, his suit you can stick them together and you've got a full <laughs> jack there there you go we have our classic Mickey pumpkin, jack-o'-lantern apple. New for this year also is our poison apple cake pop. We have our Day of the Dead items that were very popular last year. Once again, one of our top sellers this year. Coming across over to here, another brand new apple is our Evil Queen. Just in time for Once Upon a Time to start back up. Yum. Our poison apple, um, caramel apples dipped in caramel with white chocolate to create a space. Our Jack and our pumpkin cake pop, and last but not least, is our Mummy Crispy Treat. All right. Now, do you have a favorite sweet treat out of all these to make? Out of these ones, <laughs> I like doing the Jack. I like I like drawing Jack. Yeah, face. he looks good too. Let's yeah. to eat. <laughs> so today we're gonna have you make our mini witch apple. Ooh, I'm excited. You ready? I am so ready. All right. So you're gonna grab one of our our pre-dipped Granny okay. Smith apples. All right. So this is Granny Smith apple dipped in caramel with marshmallow ears, and you could go ahead and submerge that all the way into the chocolate. Am I doing this right? Yes, you are. Okay. Just want to make sure we get it all the way covered. Looks good, and as you bring it up and you shake it, it'll fill in any gaps that you had left. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and set that down. And through our Disney magic, we have one that's set. Usually it takes about 10 to 15 minutes to set. Okay. We have one already ready for you. Perfect. So you're gonna go right here into the white chocolate, which is gonna start to create her dress. You're gonna go ahead and submerge her straight down. Okay, straight down. And then go ahead and bring her up. I'm gonna shake that off. So from this point, I'll take the apple. Okay. Because you're gonna grab our orange candies. And those are gonna be her polka dots. All right. So Minnie gets eight polka dots. So I'll hold this, go ahead and grab those. Okay. And you're gonna alternate high and low all the way around. Alrighty. Oh no. How am I doing? Doing good. Okay. <laughs> all right. Perfect. Got a couple more. Thank you. Almost lost that one. <laughs> so for here, to create her purple dress, we have our purple sugar. Okay. Go ahead and grab a nice big scoop of that, and I'll rotate that as you sprinkle the white chocolate. This looks so good. Uh, 
perfect. So we're gonna go ahead and set her down. Grab a stick. Okay. You're gonna put that into the chocolate and we're gonna attach that is with the glue. Oh. With her purple hat. Okay. Her hat is also made out of chocolate. We get them made especially for Minnie. Looks so good. I love chocolate. Love chocolate. And then you're gonna go ahead and attach this to the front of her ears. Okay. Just like that. And that is our mini witch apple. That's awesome. Look what I did. Oh my goodness. Now you can find these treats in both parks, correct? Both parks and in downtown Disney at Marceline's. Awesome. So please grab your favorite Halloween goodies this Halloween season at the Disneyland Resort. Now during the party, most of the attractions are open, but there are two that you must see while you're here. Now, during the holidays, Halloween through Christmas, behind me, the Haunted Mansion has a overlay that is themed to the Nightmare Before Christmas. And over in Tomorrowland, you can ride Ghost Galaxy, which is over at Space Mountain. And it's terrifying. The ride's terrifying without the Halloween light overlay, but anyways, let's go ride. at the Haunted Mansion Holiday, and we're here with Brian. Now, can you please tell me, what, what can we expect here at Halloween time at Disneyland Park? Well, at the resort, you can see pumpkins galore. There are pumpkins everywhere. Pump we have hundreds of pumpkins in the Haunted Mansion Holiday. Out on Main Street, we have Great Big Pumpkin Mickey and thousands of pumpkins on, on the street, so pumpkins galore. Oh, perfect. Now, do you have, or, you know, with Jack and Sally, do you have a favorite room inside the Haunted Mansion Holiday? Uh, that's very, very difficult. You know, I love them all. Each room has got something new and mm -hmm. something different. Um, I do like the, the graveyard because that's where we get to see Jack. Mm -hmm. And then Sally has joined the party this year, so she's also in the graveyard. So I think that's my favorite room this year is the graveyard. Great. Well, thank you so much, Brian. Thank you so much, Jack and Sally. And that sums it up here at the Haunted Mansion Holiday at Disneyland Park. Happy Halloween! Okay, guys, of course I had to stop in the Emporium before I left to go look at the 2016 official Mickey's Halloween Party merchandise. You have t-shirts, ornaments, sweatshirts, hats, anything you could think of, they've got it here at the Emporium and all over the park for that matter. Now, I saw an ornament that I really want, so um, sorry Gavin, if you're watching, I've gotta get it. <laughs> I'm gonna go get it before it sells out. <laughs> Thank you.
go see the Frightfully Fun Parade, new for 2016. I cannot wait to see this. Everyone has been talking about it and been rave reviews. I cannot wait to see all the villains come out and cavalcade down Main Street, USA, the original one. Now, everyone's already taking their spots. I want to get a good spot because obviously it's a new parade. So uh, let's go out there. here at Disney's Hollywood Tower Hotel. Can you uh, tell me what's going on here today? Hi. Thanks for checking in for our final checkout before January 2nd. Oh my goodness. Now, uh, have you enjoyed your time working here at the hotel? They've worked me to death. This is my happy face. <sighs> Make sure you check out the Silver Lake Sisters. They used to play in the tip-top room. Now they'll sing here for you live in the lobby. Oh, and if you're brave enough, come back after twilight hours where you drop in complete darkness. Yes, he should be. Now at the end of Main Street USA is a great place to grab a spot to enjoy Halloween Screams, a villainous surprise in the skies that's hosted by Jack Skellington himself. Now let's not waste any more time and let's go grab a spot for ourselves to enjoy this show. And now I say the best for last, the So that pretty much sums up Mickey's Halloween party here at Disneyland Park in California. I think I scored with trick-or-treating around the park and I got my merchandise. Like I told you, I had to get that ornament. So sorry Gavin, but uh, I think it's time to go home. Gavin is still somewhere around the park. I think he's still running around trying to find more candy, but I don't care because I totally won this round. Sorry Gav, but uh, all right. well. That sums it up, and let's go back home. All right, so you're right. Disneyland in the fall, it's beautiful. I love that park so much. 
I told you, it's so gorgeous. I personally love the big Mickey pumpkin in Town Square because it reminds me of Halloween Town. Remember that? Remember that show? It's amazing. It's, it's, it's Look it up if you, know, if you know what it is. Good movie, good movie. Right. <laughs> Halloween Screams. That is a wonderful fireworks show that you have to see when you go there. And I, I love how Jack Skellington actually is the host of that mm -hmm. show. And they do projections with his face. And I know. I loved cool. like Zero when he flies over the castle. That was so neat. I love their technology over there at Disneyland. And also the new parade that premiered this year, the Frightfully Fun Parade. Come on! I really enjoyed it because yeah. I would watch on YouTube like their little uh, Halloween cavalcade that they had every year. And it was okay. It was good. But it wasn't boo to you. But now I think this is a perfect addition for uh, Mickey's Halloween party. Perfect addition. I loved it. Loved it. So I'm going back next year. I think we, we need to do this again. I'm okay with that. Yeah. I'm okay with that. We need to start playing <laughs> that. We need to start playing that now. Oh, yeah. The food, amazing. Oh, everything. gosh, yes. Everything. Food, yes. That's one of the reasons why I want to go back is because of all the treats. I will say it again, Disneyland with their special holiday treats, tr like it just tops Walt Disney World. Mm -hmm. Disneyland knows where it's at when it comes to food. So good. And we love our food. <laughs> so and you guys, <laughs> make sure until next time you subscribe to Attractions Magazine. And follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Florida e Ticket. And of course, make sure you get out, have fun, and, and enjoy, enjoy Florida. Wait. California. California. Well, both. Go out and enjoy both.